All right, so I just have a basic piece of half inch rope here. I don't really use it for anything. Uh, you take one end if you want to do a top line hitch. And I've got this little ring. You could use this to slip off the pin as opposed to wearing on the rope. So you just make your, make your loop and you take the working end let's see that's a bit better Oops, hold on okay so the rope's gonna go up this is the this end would go to the pouch and here I've got my loop and here's the working end I'm going over inside the loop and then I come and I go in again so I've wrapped it inside the loop twice and then I go out on the outside and I continue wrapping in the same direction and then when you're done you really have to futz with it and dress it nice So what you should have is it, it comes in, it goes around the inside twice, and then it comes up and over, and it goes around the outside. And because you keep wrapping in the same direction, the tag end should be pointing in a line from here. But then I have my loop with my ring, and when you pull on it, it doesn't collapse and uh, I use this on my real sling and I, I haven't even really had the sling uh, like shrink at all during shooting it's a crazy knot but then when there's no tension on it and if you want to shorten your sling all you do is grab the knot the whole package and just slide it up then you have a bigger loop so that's taken up more length, so you've just shortened your swing. Then you pull on it again, and it stays tight. So that's just the magic there. It is uh, not as secure as some other ways of doing things. I imagine some people don't like this idea. But really, as long as you uh, it's inspect the knot briefly before you shoot everything, just it's all about dressing it nice. I'm sure there's plenty of tutorials on YouTube on how to do this. So that's just what I do to adjust the sling quick and easy. You know, you can shorten it just a little bit. If you think about it, the rope that you pull into the loop then gets divided in half. Let's see. Yeah, so you're only, as you pull the knot up, if you pull three inches in to the loop you're only actually shortening the swing an inch and a half so you actually have a lot of control on how long the swing is uh, so cool fact and then yeah you'd have your loop on the one end and then this would go to the pouch and this is this is solidly fixed to the pouch and doesn't go anywhere so